Hello, it's Dynamic Dan here, and today I'm thinking all about the part of the Easter story where Jesus dies on the cross. Now, of course, this isn't a very happy part of the story, which is why I've got this rather sad looking balloon right here. And the people that follow Jesus must have felt broken hearted by this news. A bit like this picture, it must have felt like their lives were falling apart. And you know, sometimes when we feel sad, it can feel like it actually hurts, and we can end up feeling like we've got a broken heart. And yes, although this is a sad story, it also reminds me of love. You see, it says in the Bible that God so loved the world that he gave his only son. And Christians believe that God's love is bigger than any sadness, any hurt or suffering, and that he can even heal a broken heart. Well, that was the ultimate sacrifice. And for people who follow Jesus, we believe that because he died and rose again, our hearts can be healed through him. Christians think that God's love is endless and bigger than anything else. So let's see if we can do something bigger with this heart. It goes in the bag, a little shake and a click. And let's see if it's worked. Wow, I think it has, look. Wow, a great big heart. Look at the size of it. Wow. Of course, we all get sad, but remember, sometimes good things can come from sad situations. Just like in the story, Jesus died on the cross, which was very sad. But it meant that for Christians like me all over the world, we believe that we can experience his love for ourselves. And that is well worth smiling about. Much better. Well, I've been Dynamic Dan. Thanks for watching. Stay awesome and bye for now.